Hello, hope you're well. I'm just doing a weekly vegan food shop at Tesco's and Sainsbury's. And it's the week I'm going to start the challenge, which I'll go into depth on in the next video, which I'll record shortly. But this is a mixture of Tesco's and Sainsbury's, and I'll go through it very quickly and explain. I picked up the plant-based Merchant Gourmet Korean-style grains, zingy grains, clearly marked vegan, on offer at £2. I picked up the New York... Sesame bagels, also from Sainsbury's. They're on offer a pound at the moment, so I like them, so I've got them. And finally, from Sainsbury's, not a lot really, go for it in a minute. The shallots, 400 grams, a pound also. Makes a nice change. So I thought, yeah. sorry, that's Drake trying to go in the bag. I've got food, I've got other foods, but um, they're all reference to the challenge. Uh, now, the rest is Tesco. So I picked up black grapes, seedless black grapes for £1.80. I've got the plant chef margarita pizza, which is normally £3.15. The Richmond sausages, which are usually two twenty-five. The Vivera plant steaks, which are usually two eighty-five. The Plant Chef fish-free goujons, which are one seventy, and the Plant Chef organic tofu, which is one eighty-five. And finally, a Wicked Kitchen all-day Mexican-inspired breakfast wrap, normally three twenty-five, but it's free for the price of two. So I paid for four out of the six items. So technically, that, that, and that was one deal. I can tell you now, I saved one seventy. That, that, and that's the other deal, and I saved 2.25. And I just did it for a bit of stock up in the fridge. I picked up some oat cakes. We should, they're here, they're in the next challenge as well, but they're £1.10, and I haven't got any, so they are technically this week's food shop. Finally, and almost finally, I got four of the Growers Darby's Soya drinks and sweetened for 50 pence each. They are back in stock. Bit of a relief there, Jane, you were right. Um, yep, yeah, there. I got an Our Pro strawberry flavoured yogurt on offer at £1.50. This bad boy, this pepper here, was at Sainsbury, sorry. Normally 69 pence apparently, but 50 pence. And I thought, they're all on offer to Nectar card deal. So I thought I'd get that. And finally from Tesco's, a yellow pepper for 59 pence. As I said, I've got a lot of food in the fridge and a lot of food in the freezer. I'm going to do a food challenge. Um, I've got from different tangents tonight. So. The corn, um, I took a picture I can't remember now. I'll do it in another video. The corn mini fillets we were talking about, I think it was egg. It was either egg or milk is the ingredient they put in to make them non-vegan anymore. I took a picture when I was in there. I went and checked it out. But, so I'll leave that there. And um, yeah, I've got the rest of the food, bits and pieces, but I don't really need them this week in the part of the food challenge. So we'll go through that later on. Um, so I'm going to do the food challenge, the basics, which I talked about in the video. I'm going to do Tesco's and Sainsbury's this week. I went to Sainsbury's first, give them a fair shot. Then I went to Tesco's and I'm going to see how they can compare to each other. Next week, I'm going to do Asda and Morrison's. In the final week, I'm going to do Little Naldi. And what I'll do is I'll do it all equally the same. Pick up a few bits like this is my weekly vegan food shop while I'm there. I don't want to keep going food shopping. And then I'll do a rundown from one to, you know, and rate them all basically. They're all going to have some better than ever, I'm sure. But we'll see. This could be the reason. I'm open to justify, to be honest with you, the reason why. I stick with Tesco's week in, week out, but I could be completely biased and completely wrong on this, so we'll see. So, yeah, this is the weekly vegan food shop. If you've got this far, please give it a thumbs up. It helps your algorithm. It really does. Um, something you get used to, please subscribe. That would be amazing. Please feel free to leave a comment. I've got through a few comments today. I will try and finish them off today, stroke tomorrow. And more importantly, please, and I do appreciate them on it, really do. Some of them are very insightful to different things around the world and local you know and people's dietary requirements and i you can never cease to be amazed to be honest with you so i'll say that there and please as always take care and stay safe until the next one thanks again for watching bye